Firstly, apologies on my behalf. Um, I'm probably a little late covering this news. It came out a couple of hours back. But I've been so busy cleaning out my garden, sorting out my garden. These COVID times, people, I mean, my house has never been so clean. My car is sparkling. My house is gleaming. My garden, you could lick the patio floor. It's that clean. It's just ridiculous. So, yeah, guys, I apologize being a little late on this news, but we'll get straight into it in a quick second. How's it going, guys? My name's DPJ, and today I'll bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like, it really helps out. And subscribe if you do want to see more. So, a new event is coming tomorrow with Mayhem 2.0 and the Revenge of the Cartels event. This new loot event is called Loot the Universe. So we're just going to go straight through exactly what Gearbox posted on their website. New mini events, Loot the Universe. Farm some legendaries across the galaxy during Borderlands 3's Loot the Universe mini events. As the co-op loot drop event approaches its April 30th end date, we've got a new series of mini events lined up to sate your lust for loot. Along with Mayhem 2.0 and the Revenge of the Cartels seasonal event, the April 23rd patch kicks off Loot the Universe, a four week tour of the Borderlands 3 solar system that's perfect for legendary loot farming. Each week during the Loot the Universe, one of the Borderlands 3's planets will become a proverbial gold mine of loot, where specific types of legendary loot have an increased chance of dropping in one of the planet zones. The affected zones have their own dedicated legendary weapon type, pistol, shotgun, SMG, assault rifle, sniper or heavy and may also have increased chances for legendary gear types, class mods, artifact shields or grenade mods. For example, you'll find different kinds of legendary loot in the Meridian Metroplex vs Atlas HQ during Prometheus week of Loot the Universe. We want you to discover which types of legendary loot in which zones for yourselves, but here's a schedule for all the planets that will be affected during the Loot the Universe. Week 1 9 a.m. PT, April 23rd, to 8.59 a.m. PT, April 30th, and that is on Pandora. Week 2, 9 a.m. PT, April 30th, to 8.59 a.m. PT, May 7th, on Promethea. Week 3, 9 a.m. PT, May 7th, to 8.59 a.m. PT, May 14th, Eden 6. And week 4, 9 a.m. PT, May 14th, to 8.59 a.m. PT, May 21st, on Necrotafio. While you're out there farming for some sweet legendary loot, experienced players should test their metal in the reworked Mayhem mold, which can grant improved loot depending on which Mayhem level you've selected. We hope you enjoy Loot the Universe's 4 weeks of prosperous weapon and gear farming, and that you find the item that you've been searching for. So that's pretty cool people, it really is, and again that drops tomorrow if you're watching this on the 22nd. It drops tomorrow 23rd, so this will coincide with Mayhem 2.0 and Revenge of the Cartels, which is just going to be absolutely incredible. I cannot, it's going to be so busy, it's unbelievable. But the video doesn't end there, people. We also have a few extra goodies on behalf of Borderlands, including a free legendary weapon, which you must redeem via your shift account. So getting into this. Zoom across the Borderlands universe with these virtual backgrounds. And what they basically do is, there are at least 9 virtual backgrounds, video files, which you can freely download, which you'll find linked within that video description, you're also seeing them on screen now. But with this post, they also drop a free a legendary weapon, the conference call, a legendary shotgun, from your friends at Hyperion, the code you will see on screen now. So get yourselves a free a legendary people. But yes, on that note, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new and here and want to see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video or upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I'll see you on that next one.